right, let's get started. Put that ball in between your legs. All right, let me scoodoodle my rebounder back so you guys can see me here. I have a feeling I'm gonna get cut out. So right here, welcome to today's rebounder cardio circuit workout. This is an intermediate level workout today. We have seven working tracks. Right now we're just warming up and we're doing the beautiful health bounce. You have your weights by your side. I have fives and I have eights. The reason we're using this small deflated ball is so we track our hips, knees, ankles, and toes forward. Soft bend in your knee, shoulder set back, and down. So you want your shoulder set back, down, and away from your ears. I've been teaching rebounding for 23 years now, and I am using a leaps and rebounds. Yes, rebounders can be expensive. This rebounder I've had five years, highly economical, and I got it out the door for $200. It is a bungee rebounder and I highly recommend it. First track, track one. We're focusing on the health bounce. We're saying hello to our body. Hello to our lymphatic system, our digestive system, our connective tissue. We're just being nice and very gentle with our body as we just warm up with this beautiful health bounce. All right, so we're gonna start rolling those shoulders back. Let me press into the mat. Can you press into the mat for me? Beautiful job. Just continue. We're warming up in through the shoulder blades right here. Great. Beautiful job. Just rolling it back. Whew. Now you're going to take your arms up, fingertips to the ceiling and coming down, starting to warm up and through the back, you guys. Take it up and take it down. Again, take it up and take it down. Just warming up in track one. Take it up and take it down. One more. Take it up and take it down. So we're still pressing into the mat. Let's just go side to side, right here. Beautiful side to side movement. Just go side to side here. I want to really warm it up nice and gentle. Never go really slamming hard in your workouts. Let's just be nice and gentle. Side to side. Now let's take our hands, circle them in and out. Beautiful job. Circling in and out, pressing into the mat. You're not rolling on the outside of your heels. You're not rolling too far, work, too far forward on the inside of your heels. You're just doing a beautiful press down, soft bend in your knees. So nice and neutral, pressing down nice and even between that right and left leg. Reverse your circle. Reverse that circle. Whew. Opening up and through the upper body. Lower body's getting nice and warm as you're pressing down right here beautiful job continue that press down and the big arm circles in and out your timing can you do that for me hands on your hips pressing down into the mat right here don't roll on the outside of your foot or on the inside of your foot now look at my body mechanics my shoulders are set back down and away from my ears I've got a slight forward flexion all right, we are gonna start our cardio. Every minute on the minute. We're gonna work that forward and backward motion. When she tells you to hit it, you're gonna come forward and come back, just like this. Let's go. Let's just go ahead and start it. Let's get a little extra bonus. Still holding that ball in between your knee. Right here, track two, cardio. Three, two, one, go. Every minute, on the minute. Pressing forward and back. Now, if you want to press through the heels to really activate the glutes and the hamstrings, go ahead. 45 seconds here. Forward and back. Let's go. Just forward and back, your timing. 45 seconds, I said every minute on the minute. Whew. it might be 
don't see yeah it is every minute on the minute right here now if you want that added caloric output use your arms use your arms let's go when I tell you to three two one we're gonna go side to side keeping that ball in between your knees you're not squeezing the ball you're just merely holding it let's go Woo. five exercises side to side right here now you can put your hands on your hips you can just focus on that bounce side to side exercise two of five every minute on the minute right here push it now use those arms if you want Whew. land nice and equal between that right don't and left stop. leg don't stop don't stop push push come on you got it your timing guys your call go as quick or as slow as you want it's one minute push three now two, to one. one go side forward hold that ball work agility here Do whatever you want with the arms. Center side. Center side. Woo! The ball comes out. Just pick it right back up. Come on, work that agility. Work that speed, reactive training. A little harder to hold the ball, right? Push, push. Three, two, one. Press go. down. Arms up and down. Press down into the mat. Let's go. Use those arms. Focus on the press down into the mat. Right here. Breathe it through. Now get the toes off the mat. Press the heels into your rebounder mat. Working and focusing on the glutes, hamstrings. Visualize the toes are coming off the mat. Pressing down Don't with the stop. heels. Don't stop. Use those arms. Every minute on the minute, guys. You get to pick how quick or how slow you're going to bounce. Press down. It's all about that press down. Glute, hamstring, calf activation. Shoulders melted away from your ears. Push, push. Whew. Press nice and equal between that right and left leg. Push. Use arms, big arm movement. Three, two, one, go. Front, back, center, and then side. Center, front, back, center, side. Center, front, back. Woo. Track three. We're going into sculpting. I know my head's getting cut off. I'll fix that in a minute. Front, back, center side to side center you can use those arms front back side to side don't stop let's go front back side to side now you don't have to use those arms look no arms place your hands on your hips you're pressing nice and equal between that right and left leg push it Breathe it through, you guys. You're almost there. Active Three, two, recovery. One, go. Okay, here we go. All right, here we go. We're getting ready to go into sculpt. I'm gonna grab my eight. Now you can step touch side to side. We're gonna do beautiful bicep curls and hammer curls. 45 Three, seconds, two, track one, three. Go. Bicep curl, hammer curl. 45 seconds. Now, if you want, you do whatever you want here. 
Or you can have your feet hip width apart. Woo! And weightlifting stance. Shoulder set back down and away from your ears. Track three. It's all about that sculpt and tone. Revving up our metabolism. Working muscular endurance. Now my husband is dancing in the background. Do you want to come and show everyone? Dancing? He doesn't want to show everyone. He's going like this. That's what he's doing. Woo! Three, two, one, go! Go ahead. Upright row. Beautiful job, 45 seconds. Now again, you can do a beautiful split stance. You can do these exercises on the floor. You guys, what I love about rebounding. Low impact, joint friendly. Beautiful for the lymphatic system, the digestive system, connective tissue, and helps detox. Woo! Come on, let's go. Let's go. Beautiful track three. Today's a circuit style class. I'm playing with the time frame that we do the exercises. So some exercises are 45 seconds, Three, two, some are 60. One, Take it up, 60 seconds here. Overhead tricep extension. Now go as fast or as slow as you wanna go. We worked biceps, we worked shoulders. We are working triceps. Woo, 60 seconds guys. Track three of seven, you're halfway there. You get a beautiful little recovery. Woo! Let's go. Don't stop. Don't stop. 30 more seconds. Oh, after this week, man. We're burning it. Beautiful. Rebounder cardio. Sculpt right here at its best. Working your entire body today. Revving up your metabolic rate. Your resting metabolic rate. Interspersing cardio. Bounce and weights. You're here to challenge and change your body. Three, Quick two, break. One, rest. Quick break. All right, we're gonna do one more exercise, 60 seconds. We're gonna go into a beautiful wide squat. Now watch me. We're gonna do a dumbbell. They call them a kettlebell swing or a dumbbell swing. Come back, lift up, working back extension, working hips mobility and you're working your lower body so we're going to put the weights down your Three, timing two, one, let's power. go your timing press the weights together 60 seconds and you get a little active recovery press the weights together hinge forward from the hip feel your back extensors work as you lift those arms over your head don't let your arms go behind your ears. Soft bend in the elbow. Soft bend in the knees. Don't stop. 30 seconds. Pressing nice and equal between that right and left foot and leg. Don't put too much weight on that right leg and very little on the left. Work muscle balance right here. You're on an unstable surface. Really press down. Nice and equal between that right and left leg. Whew. Yeah, if you get off balance, that's okay. Get right back into Three, it. Two, one, Put recover. the weights down. Health bounce. Right now. You get 30 seconds recovery. Okay? Let's go back to the fundamentals. Shoulders set back down and away from your ears. Pressing nice and equal between that right and left leg. Not rolling on the outside or the inside of your foot. Don't roll too far forward on your toes or too far back on your heels. Pressing down into the mat is where the work is. Slight, slight forward flexion, soft bend in your knees. You don't want your joints locked out. Press nice and equal. A lot of people don't really press nice and equal between that right and that left leg. Shoulder step back down and away from your ears. All right, track four. Every minute, on the minute, cardio bounce. Beautiful cardio, sculpt, rebounding circuit today. Three, two, one, go. Whew. All right, let's begin to ski right here. Let's go. Come on, let's ski. 
Now your hands can be on your hips or you can begin to add the arms. Now my feet, visualize your feet are on a railroad track. Pressing down, nice and equal. Soft bend, you got a little bend in your knees. Focusing on that press down. Don't stop. Come on, let's go. You have five cardio balance exercises. Your timing, your pace. You are here to challenge and change your body in today's workout. Don't ever feel guilty for taking time to focus on your health and getting this workout in right here. That is such a gift of self-love to yourself. Go. Jack, working out and taking care of ourselves is self-love, self-nurturing, and it's a beautiful thing that we get to give ourselves each and every day. Take the opportunity to gift yourself with body movement. Never ever feel guilty for taking time for you. If you don't take time for you, how can you take time for others? You have to fill up your own self-nurturing cup with love, support, body movement, whatever, meditation, reading, journaling. It's absolutely appropriate each and every day to take this time for you. Yeah, don't ever forget that, guys. Whew. We're gonna do Three, knees. Two, one, two. Go. Now, if you only feel you can do your legs, you can always put your hands on your hips. If you want the arms to go with you, add the arms. You are here to embrace this beautiful rebounding cardio sculpt challenge today. Listen to your body at all times. Go where you need to go. Come on. Right here. Push. I love cardio bounce and sculpt rebounding workouts. It's a beautiful way to work your entire body. Rev up your metabolism. Sculpt tone to fine. Work on heart health and bone health. Beautiful way to get it all done in one workout. Three, two, Kick. one, go. Right here. Now arms can come out. Press arms out. You can even cross your arms. Right here. You're almost done. We track four of seven. No more cardio after this. Sculpt, core, and cool down is on tap for the last three songs. So I want you to push. Don't stop. Don't stop. Right here. Kick forward, press your arms forward and back. Shoulders melted away from your ears. Whew. Who's working guys, teammate, team members? Who's working here? Beautiful workout today. Low impact, joint friendly. High intensity, yet low impact. Woo! Three, two, one, go! All right, jog. This is it, guys. You want to exaggerate the jog? You can lift those arms up and down, pressing nice and equal. Remember the work is when you come in the mat. You never, a lot of people think rebounding is jumping high, like a big trampoline. The work, and rebounding is a press down. Also, if you have soft, stop. medium, or firm bungees, that's going to make a difference in your work. Push it here. Whew. Beautiful job. Come on, job. Pretty quick. Exaggerate the arms if you can. All right, here we go. Grab your light hand weights right now. Track five, we're going back into sculpt. I have my eights in my hands right here. 
All right. My feet are wide. My weights are in front. Woo! Let's go into a beautiful Three, white two, squat. One, go. Touch the weights to your mat. You're in a beautiful wide squat. Pressing down nice and equal between that right and that left heel. Remember, you're on an unstable, unsteady surface. Your core is naturally going to engage. Shoulders melt away from your ears. Pressing down nice and equal. You can lift the toes off of your mat. Press down through your heels. Press up through your heels. Can you do that for me? Right here. Beautiful. Lower body. Sculpt tone and define. Working on hip mobility. A little bit of back because look. Three, two, one, rest. Okay. We're going to come up. And we're going to come down. Palms face in towards your body. And then palms face in towards your ears. Your feet can be hip width apart. You can be in a wide stance. Let's get the palms face in. Three, two, one. Let's go. One, 45 go. seconds. I don't care how quick or how slow. So palms face in. Turn them around. Palms face up. Let's go. So you turn the palms in. Your timing. Turn the palms away. Working that upper body. Now, we're going to put the weights down in a minute, and we're going to do push-ups on our mat, because I want to work. Actually, not yet. Not yet. But we will. So palms face in, and then you turn them away. Then palms face up. Three, two, one, rest. Whew. All right. So. What we're going to do next, our feet are going to be hip width apart on this unsteady surface, shoulders back. We're going to do a beautiful deadlift, and then deadlift, three, row. One, so you go. do one deadlift by itself, and then you do one deadlift, row, and then you come up. So it's one deadlift all by itself, working the entire posterior chain. One deadlift, then one deadlift, weights come to your knee. Squeeze a lemon in between your shoulder blades. Come up. Just like that. So when you do the deadlift and back row, you don't take the weights to your mat, only to your knee. Shoulders melt away from your ears. Pressing nice and equal between that right and that left foot. Be Three, very careful. Two, one, rest. Okay, are you ready? We are gonna go into push-ups right here. Hands are on your frames. This is working your entire body. Woo! You're gonna go down and Three, up. Three, two, Let's one, go. Oh. Your timing goes quick or as slow as you need to go. This is it, you guys. We're getting ready to hit core. And then cool down and stretch. Working your entire body today. Beautiful sculpt, tone define, and heart health workout today. You're embracing this beautiful challenge. You're focusing on what your body can do for you. You're strong, fit, and powerful. You're taking this time to give your body some beautiful self-love with Three, body two, movement. Three, two, one, recover. Woo! All right, are you ready? You're gonna grab your ball. Can you do that for me? If you have something in the way, we're going into core. Track six of seven is core. You're going to grab your ball. You can grab your light hand weights. You're going to put the ball in between your knees. Now, you're not giving it a really hard squeeze. I have my fives right here. We're getting ready to go into core. So, teammate and partner, you got a big thumbs up. You sweat like crazy. Ready? Let's roll and come up. Right now, you're in track six of seven. All about core and balance. So you're not squeezing the ball. You're just holding it. Three, two, Let's one, go. go. Shoulders melt away from your ears. Right here. We have four core exercises. I have five pounds in my hand. When you come to the top, come to a complete stop. Don't roll onto your neck and don't roll on your head. Right here. 
feel that beautiful core engagement. This is a full body move. I love this. Keep going. Woo, belly button to the spine. Focus on that balance, coordination. A lot of coordination balance right here. Three, two, All right, here we go. Rest. Legs up, down while you're resting. Knees come to the hip height or hip level. Down and up. So you lift, come down to the rebounder frame, knees in. Three, two, so one, you can go. go up, your timing. Move through that wet cement. Now you can leave your upper body on the rebounder surface, or you can take it off, and you can hold your two weights, pressing together, shoulder off the mat, right here. Just adding that extra core challenge. Shoulders off the rebounder surface. Moving through that wet cement. Go as fast or as slow as you want to go. You don't have to stick to my pace. No tension in the head, neck, or shoulders. If you're feeling tension in the head, neck, or shoulders, you can hold your weights up. Soft bend in the elbow. Three, two, Woo. one, rest. All right, so weights off to your side. Now you can have your knees bent. We're gonna go side to side. Your bottom knee does not touch the rebounder mat. Or your legs, straight Three, legs. Three, two, one, go. Tip tock, right here. Your bottom leg does not touch the mat. You can have straight legs or you can have bent legs or bent knees. Your call, everyone has their upper body rested into the mat. Your rebounder mat. We're not doing anything with the upper body because I'm doing spinal rotation. So I don't want your upper body involved at all. Now remember, you can just have your knees going side to side, guys. That's it. You don't have to have straight legs. So you see Three, that? Two, one, all right. Rest. So next one, we're gonna go legs down and legs up. So before we did the bend and up, we're gonna go straight down straight up here we go. One, go you can press the weights together and hold it you can take the shoulders off that rebounder surface but once you feel the tension in your head neck and shoulders you're gonna relax right here working trunk flexion right here move through the wet cement holding the weight is just gonna give it a little extra oomph and push Soft bend in your elbows though. Down, beautiful job guys. We're gonna really stretch it out in track seven. Beautiful, moving through that wet cement. Three, two, one. All right, put that weight off. You're gonna use your ball. You're still gonna use your ball. All right, so we're gonna come back on. We're gonna place the ball in between our knees. We're gonna go into a beautiful half bounce right here. Let's go into that beautiful half bounce. All right, so we always finish the way we started, but I'm gonna add some beautiful stretches in. Awesome job today, awesome job. We did a beautiful workout for heart health and for bone health. I am so very proud of you. When you run short on time and you really need to get one good workout in, these are the style of workouts I really recommend. Whew, let's just start in the health bounce. You're in the health bounce. Right here. Shoulders are rolling back, right? Whew, we're just ending right how we started. I love to give our body that time, again, just to focus on the lymphatic, digestive system pressing nice and equal between that right and that left leg let's circle in and out pressing down into the mat soft bend in your knees pressing nice and equal between that right and left leg you're not squeezing the ball you're just merely holding it 
really engages that pelvic floor by simply holding that small deflated ball. Now I do want you to reverse. Just a beautiful health bounce. Heart rate's coming back down into that recovery zone, right? Whew. Beautiful job today. You are here to transform your body one rebounding workout at a time. And I definitely say you did that. All right, just take it side to side. Still in that health bounce, focusing on the press down. Just side to side. If you want, you can look over your shoulder if it makes you feel dizzy. Don't look over your shoulder. Whew. If you've never rebounded and you're watching this video, look in the description box below by a leaps and rebounds rebounder. It's the most economical bungee rebounder for the most affordable price for an entry level rebounder. I've owned mine for five years. All right, we're gonna take the ball off. You're gonna throw it on the ground. Let's do that health bounce without the ball. Soft bend in your knee, hips are nice and open, shoulders set back down and away from your ears, pressing nice and equal between that right and left leg. Remember, we're not rolling out or in on our foot. Tailbone is slightly tucked under, pelvic floor, natural engagement. Now we're gonna stop the health bounce. We're gonna take that left arm up and over, eye gaze to the ceiling, lateral stretching. Right here, our feet are still hip width apart. And now take the right arm up, up and over. One more time, left arm, eye gaze to the ceiling, elbow, left elbow to the ceiling, one more. Whew, beautiful job. We're gonna do a deep forward fold stretch, soft bend in your knees, reach for your frame, or hands can come on your rebounder surface. Head is nice and loose. You're gonna feel the stretch in your calves, your hamstrings, your butt, glutes, in your back, no tension in the head, neck, or shoulders, just release. Soft bend in your knee, roll it up, one vertebra at a time, interlace your fingers, chest expansion, open, Woo! working on balance, just by standing on this mini trampoline surface, right here, chest expansion, right ear, right shoulder, left ear, left shoulder, one more, right ear, right shoulder. And left ear, left shoulder. Deep breath in. And a beautiful exhale. One more time. A beautiful inhalation. And press down into the mat. Soft bend in your knees, let's finish with a really small, small health bounce. Right here, let's finish with that beautiful health bounce. Just palms face away, shoulders set back down and away from your ears. Just really letting that body come back down. Whew, we got it up there, the heart rate. Beautiful, I love to health bounce each and every day, guys. I always take the time in each and every rebounding class to warm up with the beautiful health bounce because it has so many beneficial effects on our body and always ending with a phenomenal, beautiful health bounce. Just really getting the benefits for our lymphatic digestive system, cellular detox, connective tissues. All right, this is it, we're done. Inhale. And exhale, be sure to look in the description box below. Buy yourself a leaps and rebounds if you don't have one. At the end of the day, it doesn't matter what rebounder you have. We're all here together rebounding. I just want people to know they think rebounders are highly expensive. And I want them to know that there is an entry-level rebounder that even I recommend and I've had for five years. Look in the description box below. Until next time, guys, bye.